Hello and welcome back to the Mile High Burst Sunday for August 2024. It's your boy, Sidi Mangaka, able to get things switched on over so we can begin the start, begin the start, start the beginning of our Street Fighter VI Top 4 Bracket 4 today. We had a pretty uh, small, intimate bracket overall for Street Fighter VI today, but that's kind of par for the course, I feel like, for these Sunday events. They're a little more mellow, a little more chill overall. I've been up here running the computer all day as it is, but for our winner's final match, we're going to have TC versus Rick Roop today as our number one and two seats throw down. TC was able to start off by beating Yinja 3-1, then Havoc Noah 3-0, and now he's here in winner's final. Uh, Rick Roop was able to defeat Keysby 3-1, as well as take it over Slugbug in a close 3-2 set to get into winner's final. Our loser's semifinal is going to consist of Havoc, Noah, and Revenant. I'm giving the players a quick little thumbs up just to make sure that they know that they are ready to play. It is going to be TC on the Rashid, player one side, and Rook Group on the Marissa, player two side. I want to thank you all for watching and supporting the Colorado FGC at Akihabara Arcade. It's part of the Mile High Burst community. Let's get into our top four winners final. Starting off with a nice little short sequence into a throw. Wake up, crouch, medium kick from TC. will call out the heavily delayed pressure from Rick Group, a run up throw. Sending the Cyclone, trying to scout out the jump. And now TC, very close to burnout here with how he spent his resources. Rick Rupp at full drive gauge, but one thing y'all should know about Rick Rupp, if he continues to play the way I've seen him play, that drive gauge is not long for man, but TC able to slow things down. Bait out throw with a back dash, but there's TC. I noticed this last time he played at the monthly, I think, where there's these odd moments where you're expecting like a normal or something to come out from his Rashid, but instead he just stands there. I feel like he's missing some inputs. A slick walk back, catches Rick Group teching a throw once again. That'll be the first round over. Here we go, Rick Group starting off very explosively. Get some cute jump Oki, delays the normal just long enough to I think catch TC jumping. The command throw as well comes through as we scoot him. Run forward, bait the spinning mixer. It's a perfect for Rick Group. What a retaliation in our second round of winner's final set. Yeah, I'm not going to lie, I'm biased. The more competitive that this is, I think the better our chances fare for running various of the other games. Havoc Noah has been speed running the Guilty Gear Strive bracket as it is. And uh, got speed to him for that one too because we have a whole round of loser seconds that we have to go through. We had a top three placer, Saijo, effectively holding up our Strive bracket just because he was making a great Skullgirls run. but we're able to kind of get things back on track. Rick Roop is in burnout. Very common occurrence for him here, but he should be able to force TC into burnout as well with this level three. TC with just super meter to his name to defend himself. As all three bars, the correctly timed level three could work. Wake up, crouch. Nah, why you built like that? Why are you built like that? These crouch medium kicks calling out Rick Roop. And the players, Already thinking about the next round in the middle of that cinematic. It's going to be up here. That's one thing I've noticed where Rick Group has been caught by a bunch of these wake up low kicks from TC. And I think he needs to start calling them out with like properly timed meaties to prevent TC from getting this extra damage, getting these complete reversals, as it were, of situations. I'm going to be marking some matches for the Gears of Gear Strive stream to go down after this. Because you have plenty of matches. All right, the level one here. Not enough to kill TC. Will get caught by the throw, however, as once again TC demonstrates, or rather Rick Group demonstrates that he is not at all scared of putting himself into burnout if it means he's able to press his offense just a little farther. Looks like we had 11 competitors for, no, excuse me, 13. I feel like there should be. No, there's there's 13. 13 times 5 is 65. 7 for third. Okay, and just like that, Rook Group answers back. And before I can even show off the players, we're right into the next game. So let's see, six and a half times three, 18, 19 dollars. Three, four. 
Where are you going? She asks. Oh, again? Okay, Rick Rip, I see you, doll. Sheesh. Make sure I have this calculation correct. 65, 70% of it. Oh, but it's all? That's so messed up. 10, 10, 7. 40... Uh, 45 is fine. Actually, if it's like that... Six there. Quick round there for TC. Well, relatively. All right, Red Group with a level three. Runs four. Don't forget they did nerf that Okazemi of Marisa's in the most recent patch of the game. So you're not able to get the same sort of drive rush pressure that you were able to before. It looks like Havoc Noah has been able to get himself situated in, let me see, winner's final of Guilty Gear Strive, to I think very few people surprise. So we have a slew of losers games that are gonna be running to catch up to set up the Guilty Gear Strive top four. TC, Rick Roop still finding it out. TC able to get this overhead hit, and he will take a quick set lead. Two, one. I am done counting money. I am done focusing on other things. What a whiff punish. Full confirm as well from the punish counter. Tried to shimmy backwards, but Rick Rube with the tech is able to catch TC now. A couple of jabs. Resets with the low. Oh my god, the huge way just looking for that parry. And look at this. TC's trying to like OS with the perfect parry and drive rush. Burns himself out. Rick Rube down to just a couple bars of drive gauge left. DI not close enough to the corner. And there it is, Gladius will secure that round. Dominant start once again for Rick Roop. TC starting off aggressively. Gets punished, however, as the Eagle Spike is blocked and will now be punished as Rick Roop having the corner situation. Burns himself out, goes into the command throw. Can TC escape the situation and punish Rick Roop for being overly aggressive with the drive gauge so far? Looks like a possible opportunity. Disgusting little throw afterwards, and now the Great Desert Storm. Spinning Mixer, you're plus a millionaire, and I love this from Rick Roop, just waiting. TC notices that Rick Roop wants to kind of go for these throw techs, and Rick Roop says, I'm not taking the throw here, I don't die from that. Overhead, walk back, Rick Roop letting the throws connect, and TC's recognizing this, that's why he's thrown two out in a row. Do I hear three? No, the jab, jab goes forward. Perfectly timed drive rush will actually cancel out the drive rush from Rick Roop, and once again, he is burnt out. Drive reverse will get off of me, TC also burnt out. Oh my gosh, huge opportunity. Your chip kill is a factor. TC's jump normal connects, but it is going to be the kick and the special chip damage. Final game of winner's final. Loser's side it is, Havoc Noah and Revenant. Revenant watching from the crowd below. Noah making sure that Strive is running just all fine and smooth. Able to actually get some sets called and whatnot. What a cross up. Spinning Mixer for the corner carry. Rick Roop again in burnout. Eagle Spikes are safe cancels now. And oh my gosh, the hold parry into OD Spinning Mixer just to shred through Rick Roop's armor. Again, the multi hits as well. Rick Roop's trying a reversal, but it's not working just yet. Perfectly timed Meaty's command throw catches TC. Drive reversal, get off of me. Both sides willing to use that tool. Drive reversal again from TC and Rick Roop again in burnout. Spinning Mixer will contest the jump in. Bates the level one. TC will get the drive rush punish. He is now at set point of winner's final. Drive rush crouch medium, short little conversion immediately into the level two. Run forward. And a series of fortunate events for TC. His throw with Rick Roop teched and now he gets punished. 
Plenty of damage here. Level 2 is gone. We throw Rick Group on Wake Up. And again, now Rick Group's thinking, you've been throwing me so much, I want to attack the next one. TC drops the kill combo. Nah, you did not give him this much room to play with, but alas, the combo drop means that TC finds the punish and gets himself a spot into Grand Finals on the winner's side. Really close set between the two. It really came down, I think, to TC getting most of the aggression in his favor and playing solid strike throw mix-ups that eventually got Rick Roop to bite just enough times on taking throws that weren't there for him to fall apart at the end of it all. So let's go ahead and get our loser semifinal match set up. It is going to be Havoc Noah versus Revenant. I'm going to get their names set up real quick. I don't think Noah has this as part of his tag or name or anything like that anymore. Yep, certainly doesn't. And so our two players are coming down. It's going to be our modern Luke player up against Aki. Noah's played a couple different characters. He played Marissa on release. He's been on Aki ever since that character dropped. And I think he's also, I've seen him play some M. Bison. He has played some Dictator, for that is how he runs our locals. I'm kidding. I am the dictator here. Ooh. Revenant. I do actually I do recall that in this patch, he has been playing around with the modern Ed as well, so. Quite cool of him. Alright, Noah's gonna lock him in the collar three. Yeah. Swap their names on my overlay, make sure that is all correct. Bro, man, they're they're in a dance-off. It's so slick. Revenant and Havoc Noah. Modern Ed, classic Aki. Revenant will start with the first dry rush tick throw. OD Night Pulse is gonna give Noah all this space. They do trade, but honestly, I think you're fine with that if Revenant. Here's Noah already kind of flirting with the snake step. It is a better anti-projectile tool, so I'm surprised Noah's not full sending it. Respect the frame traps, gets pulled in. Revenant will back off, tags a little bit of damage on Anoa. Now Noah put into the corner. Kill rush, able to close the gap. Nice tech there from Noah. Revenant showing that he's getting plenty handsy already. But Noah alternating between when he goes for the throw text and not. He goes for the jump, gets the cross up counter hit as. There was no DP, even with modern reactions on Revenant's side for that jump out. Oh my lord, using the start of his fireball. And then the DP to check the drive rush follow up. Revenant able to take a clean round one over Noah. Cruel Fate catches. Cinematic hit will go through. It's a poison applied to Revenant. Oh, I'm not sure what Noah was cooking with there. Maybe a throw shimmy attempt. Speaking of, Revenant gets it, has just less than a bar of drive gauge left to his name. Kill Rush comes in, catches a prairie attempt from Noah. DP, modern reactions. Another throw right here as Revenant playing this pretty clean. And there it is, changing up the timings. A quick jab into throw at the final sequence. Takes Noah down in game one. Drive Rush to start. Revenant. Puts Noah on a knockdown. Again, the kill rush to bait with the flicker charge. Catching Noah trying to perfect parry the projectile. What a jab there by Revenant contesting Noah's offense. Empty jump, DP still in time. And again, the same sequence. Noah's not even like, he, he's trying to move in after, right? Like, I think he's trying to go for a throw, but Revenant's not even trying to parry. Noah's not potentially respecting the fact that this is a modern Ed with a one button DP input. Real Fate will catch. Noah will get a full pickup off of this as well. Doesn't get the Serpent Lash onto him, but still able to hold his ground. And look at this. Noah using his anti-fireball tools now, recognizing that Revenant's more than comfortable to play with those in neutral. The anti-air whiffs from Aki. DP on the gap. Get thrown out of your parry, son. Caught jumping. Thrown after you're no longer airborne. Counter hit on that one. I'm not sure what went down, but Revenant cashes into the level three. Noah with a sliver of health. Plus on block, and they trade as well. The burnout giving Revenant enough time to frame trap Noah. Noah's gonna go back to character select actually. He's testing his buttons real quick. 
just ensuring that they're not misbound. He says, okay, no. Hasn't been working, and neither has Aki. So here comes the Dictator. M. Bison to us Americans. Nice. All right. Meanwhile, give to your strive. This bracket is catching up as we speak. We should have top four set for stream as soon as we're done here. Check the Tekken 8 bracket as well. I think we had a decent amount of people today. Just vibing. Oh, yeah, okay. We got we got progress. We got plenty of time. Tekken 8 will need it anyway. 20 people today for Tekken 8. Good stuff, y'all. Happy to see it. Now, Noah with the Bison already down to pretty low life. Going for standing pressure. Frame trap right here as well. OD scissor kicks. Plants the Psycho Mine. Backs off looking for Revenant to reversal with something. Mine detonates overhead as well. Oh my gosh, the extra aerial normal catch. And look at this, as soon as Revenant is out of burnout, spends a level one, but no! Noah didn't get the punish and he is upsetting spaghetti about it. I would be too, as Revenant did the smart thing and mashed the next reversal in case the first one wasn't punished properly. Noah lets a round slip away, drive rush into command throw. Not command throw, but normal throw. Respects, waiting for the Psycho Mind and Detonate. Perfect parry from Revenant. Back throw to put Noah into the corner. Respects the flicker. Perfectly timed jab from Noah. Scissor kicks, spaced out. Oh! Crush him. Drive rush bait. And look at this, anticipating the fireball. Revenant not scared to throw out the D-piece, however. Noah, I think he tried a perfect parry or tried to EX Psycho Crusher. Oh, but look at that. Able to skip through the neutral, catch him in the head. Noah with a round on the board. Couple of well-timed jabs. Noah just gets standing pressure reset. Revenant busts out with the DP. Noah not scouting him just yet. Stops the jump out. Full well-timed meaty. Revenant caught by the overhead, but Psycho Mine not done that detonating yet. And perfectly timed throw. Revenant escapes the mine. Has Noah in the corner under throw loop pressure. Noah tries to press. Full pickup here from Revenant. He's looking well. Good anti-air, but he drops the combo. Noah not in a position to punish it. Oh, Revenant could have punished Noah for that, I'm pretty sure. Scissor kicks at that range. Backs up. Revenant now in burnout as well. Level three. Way too soon! Noah's able to stall his jump timing. Revenant not respecting and waiting for Noah to come out of the shadow fall with an option. Everyone kind of treats it like a normal jump. Again, Noah baiting out these actions. Catches Revenant, pushes the offense. DP is an option once again. The throw, pulls up the counter hit. Drive rush, baits it out as well. Noah with the perfect sequence, calling out Revenant's tendencies and he'll get one on the board with Dictator. Nice, and this time Revenant adjusts, waits for Noah to have a second animation after Bison takes the skies. Back throw. ODDP will punish counter. And look at this, both of them just slugging this out. Reset. Nice, Revenant this time with a different aerial normal. We'll throw Noah back towards the corner. Flicker just out of range. And look at this, Revenant actually anticipating Noah to go into the sky and using the anti-air flickers. Side swap, full punish counter confirmed for Noah. Just almost out of drive gauge, Revenant as well. Nearly burning himself out with the ODDP. Look at this, yeah, Revenant's got the timing down now. Oh, look at this, Noah able to punish the fireball full screen. Fade back. Just plus enough on block. The DP rips and Noah. He's like, ah, oh, he keeps doing it. They won't stop. I assume that's why he's doing that anyway. I would be amused otherwise. Catches the back dash here as Revenant tries to just go for a shimmy. Gets a jump in, punish. No mines yet for Mycin. And I think Revenant's not quite contesting the OD follow-up there from Noah. Oh, Noah wanted that to be a shadow fall, but didn't quite get the charge input. Nice air to air. Noah stops the jump. Has full drive gauge. And now he's able to press safely here with Bison. No anti-air there. Scissors. 
Oh, just out of throw range. Remnant tries to close the gap, but Noah with a preemptive mash stops that approach. OD. We're going to break some necks out here. Nice DP. Revenant finds the timing once more. Noah holding charge. Waits for the thrower to approach. A jab as well. Perfectly calling out Revenant's attempt to shimmy backwards. All right. Anyone set still? DP. I'll check one thing real quick. Good air to air from Noah. He's once again getting the pressure. Psycho Mine is planted. Revenant has to hold most of this. Plus frames. We fade back. Revenant tries to jump to chase. No such luck. Back throw. Drive reversal too far away. Noah will get caught out by the level three anti air. Well timed from Revenant. This is going to put Noah into a bad situation as we also have Revenant back with Drive Gauge as an option. But the huge jump in from Mavic Noah, he goes into his own critical arc. Level three, excuse me. Just like that, it is our second game of five of this Street Fighter VI, top four. Okay, when Noah does do the OD head press, it is plus four on block. I was curious about that. Throw. He will stay safe, just out of range. Scissor kicks for the offense. Oh, the head press not able to be whiff punish. Catches the dash again. We escape the corner. Noah choosing positioning. Working on this reverse sweep with M. Bison. One throw from Revenant. Fireball threatened. Noah with charge. Goes with the E or the OD's mine. Psycho Crusher, I should say. These are kicks. Revenant still in burnout. Has to main, you know, respect all this pressure. No any air from Noah. The throw from Revenant. Able to save him from a die around. Set point here for Revenant. Loser semis, excuse me. This is loser semi-final, my apologies, chat. Loser's final, the winner will be fighting Rick Group. Noah will be put into the corner from the back throw. Jumps. Offense time. Scissor kicks. And now we're just trying to alternate this pressure. Noah not able to get the sequence correct. Big jump from Revenant. Has the combo kill rush, but Noah with the back tech goes back out. You tested the man's reactions. I think you try to read a fireball. Revenant with the one button super. Now has Havoc Noah at death's door. Noah still contesting in his usual ways. No level three, and there it is, the throw. Noah eliminated at fourth place. Revenant advances on to loser's final, where he's going to be taking on Rick Roop. Oops, excuse me, that's the wrong transition to go through. Good set between the players, fun stuff overall. Really, I think it just came down to like, um, so many DPs from Revenant were unread, unchecked. Noah kind of assuming that, okay, he's gotta adjust and put that away now, right? But then he just never did. So, it'd be like that, it'd be like that. Revenant will be staying on to fight against Rick Root, but we'll be seeing more of Avic Noah as he is slated to be well, he is in, I should say, winner's final of Guilty Gear Strive. So we'll see Noah as a player pull up uh, after the this set of games finishes. It's been a long day for me, y'all, and I got more to do tomorrow. I'm even crazy. All right, Revenant and Rick Roop, Modern Ed versus Mybisa. 
excited to see how these two throw down today. Do have the shout out that Slugbug was able to make it out here, but he fell to Revenant actually. Fifth place. Revenant's had a really good run, actually. He did lose to Noah earlier in the bracket. Another close 3 2 set. So that was a rematch from earlier. But then from there, Revenant made a loser's run uh, going through Big Polly, Yinja, and Slugbug to make it this far. So he's doing absolutely fantastic. Somebody's controller disconnected. All right, they're able to catch it just before the game started. No harm, no foul. Revenant and Rick Roop. Loser's final. All right, had to put the money down. Rick Roop explosively starting out. Revenant already in burnout. The drive impact, but a combo, so no wall splat. Very quick round there for Rick Roop. Checkmate for Revenant. Using our standing kicks. Trying to contest Marissa. Nice DI reaction. And Rick Roop in burnout. Revenant gonna be able to put all kinds of pressure on. Catches the back dash to end the tech. Or the back tech. Not able to get a whip punish with the drive rush, but still a throw comes through. Flicker for the plus frames. This time we do actually catch Rick Roop after the Gladius. It was not a true whip punish, but it operated as one. Going to the final round of game numero uno. Nice shimmy there. Back dashing Rick Roop to 10. Two tech a throw. Gladius, though, will break through. DP is baited. Now Rick Roop gets tons of damage. Should be able to go into the level three, putting Revenant into the corner. No drive gauge for Rick Roop, however, so there's not going to really be a strong Okazemi presence here, but Revenant just about out of burnout, and any hit will kill. Gladius, now you're in chip out. And look at this. You tested the modern reactions. A one button super comes through. Rick Roop finds the blow to take that game. 1-0 for Rick Roop. Kick on the full screen, trying to approach. Scoot him. Look at this, Rick Roop trying to control space with the Gladiuses. Burns himself out, OD Gladius into drive rush. But now let's see if Rick Roop's gonna be at all punished for it. Revenant's able to escape the corner. Plus frames, tick throw. Perfectly timed. Psycho Knuckle, just again, force the offense. Oh, look at this Gladius at the perfect range. Revenant was trying to build up the flicker charge too close to Marissa. Decked out, lights out. Good end here. Oh, but the kill rush way too late. And now Rick Roop is getting handsy, throw after throw. Oh, mistimed it. Evan Jugson back throws Rick Roop. Wake up DP from Revenant though, Rick Rubik again in burn out. Critical art available for Revenant. Burns himself out, goes for a throw. Both sides have supers available. Rick Rubik will jump. Honestly, Rick Rubik just needs to probably go for a super while Revenant's in this corner and it's a chip out. In fact, Rick Rubik should have just buffered it right there. Still finds an exit, will go up 2-0. Could have played that final situation a little more optimally. Rick Roop, though, again taking his turn. Hey, 
Good Annie here for um, Revenant. Uh, stem off the neutral. Revenant with a good life lead here. Rick group trying to close the gap. Drive reversal on wake up. We'll push Revenant away. Oh my lord. The back kill rush to evade the drive impact, but Rick group hunts him down, burns himself out. Oh, and look at this. Revenant able to actually get the situation. A meaty jump in. I mean, it was basically checkmate from there. Rick Roop, still at set point. He wins this round, we go back to winners, excuse me, grand finals. Revenant trying to keep his tournament run alive. Superman punch will be defended against. Some easy pokes, but Rick Roop just one more. I mean, look at it, he's gonna throw out a button and he's gonna drive rush cancel it. Revenant gets to it first. I love this, actually. Revenant's trying to just barely outspace Rick Roop in these skirmishes and then whiff punish him. And so far, this new approach is working. The level three comes through with punishing Gladius. Modern man. Modern Ed. Macho. Revenant might be able to get a game on the board here. Big counter hit here from Rick Roop. Burns himself out with the combo as well just to maximize the damage. Level three, here we come. Oh, yes! I have company, finally, y'all. Take all of it! All of my Take love! Take all of it! All of it! Yes. Okay, what I miss? I'm finally here. You are indeed. I barely made top four for Guilty Gear Strive. Now I'm here to watch some delicious Street Fighter Revenant Ooh, taking it over Rick. Okay, and just like that, Revenant making it yeah. interesting. I like this. I uh, don't know how I feel about the uh, Ed yet, but I do like the modern Ed. Like, I like Ed in general, but mm -hmm. interesting seeing Revenant switch from Luke, such a strong character. Well, this is this is the Ed. patch where everybody's been really down on Luke. Like, oh, really? a lot of people who have played Luke before are jumping from that ship because, oh. he, after all, the nerfs are catching up. Like, he has gone through every single patch cycle of Street Fighter VI, yeah. has lost a lot of damage, lost some potency to his strongest tools. Oh. You know, and then characters like Ken, you know, they've gotten some, like, sideways horizontal changes or a buff yeah, here and we're there. just chilling. Yeah, yeah. And now Ed, you know, he's been a very I, strong character. His stocks have risen quite a lot, and he plays very well. And, I mean, Revenant's run, I was talking about this before, uh, yeah. leading up to this point with this oh. modern Ed. He fell to Noah earlier, was able to get revenge on Noah. Yeah, I saw the first side. I didn't get to see the second set. Mm -hmm. Uh, and then Revenant oh was able to beat Big Polly, beat you, beat Slugbug 3-1 oh. with this modern Ed. So, just seems yeah. like he's playing a stronger character these days. Yeah, no, I mean, he... Oh. What was... Fuzzy Wuzzy was a bear? rising? That's disgusting. He can do that. And even then, like, Rick Roop, I think, was going for a uh, tech throw. Oh, my God. The Revenant Classic. He just gets the RickRoopDownload.com opened up in the back. <laughs> and now it's not looking good for Rick, but... We'll see. This yeah. is dangerous for Revenant. Almost close to burnout, but both sides have been very aggressive with their drive expenditure. Yeah, I seen that Revenant just burn himself out. Don't really care, honestly. Yeah, Rick Roop has a huge habit of it. He, I mean, right now at this bar, like, yeah, look at this. Oh, there OD is. special than just drive rushes. He does not it? give a damn. Oh, we are just spending it. I respect that, actually. Mm -hmm. Like, if you're already down, uh, like, if you lose the next round, it's over. Might as well take what you can get, cash out. Oh my god, is there Oki here? There's no Not Oki anymore. There. Oh, they did nerf that. To. I see. And even then, you know, if she had drive gauge, Ooh. still no Oki, really. Oh my! One button reactions. Oh, right, right, right. Modern can't glaze him too much. Got modern controls. And look at this. You know, Rick Roop can't make a move right now because he dies to a critical. <gasps> oh, they had. They, they both knew. They both just knew. Oh, oh boy! <laughs> Yo! You miscalculated, Revenant. Oh, he knew. Oh, my God. He had to go for super there. Did not have the life total to withstand the drive impact. That was so clutch on Rick's part, actually. What a what a bold choice to make, and it works out. I know, yeah. I mean, Revenant just too conditioned to go for the textbook response. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, my. Okay. Oh, what a move it. Yep. Air, very nice. Yeah, I've been getting hit by that one a lot. That ja the uppercut's pretty good. Oh my. And look at this Inhole. Revenant. He's falling into the groove that he had with Havoc Noah, where he's letting every single possible DP rock. Yeah. 
Oh my goodness. Yeah. Oh, no reaction from Rick, but that's okay. Trying to play the spacing game right now. Target combo just to get the knockdown here. Revenant will get another throw. Oh, but with oh, the throw. Big. Yeah, Rick gets to play the game. Oh, nice. Uh, I forgot the Drive reversal. That. Drive reversal. Does that cost two? Two. Drive gauge? Yeah, same as the DP. Oh, this is Rick's chance right here, but he's got to get in. But he's very, it's very scary against Ooh. a modern player. Because if you do anything haste, he gets level three. That's what he's looking for right now. Rev's definitely looking for level three right now. Right, yeah, and so you see Rick Rip's going for the quick oh. startups, but punish counter on the throw to whip punish DI, and we have yet another game five. Yay. Every one of our Street Fire Six ten sets so far. Game, game five. five. Oh, wait, what? When did that become a thing? Bars. She she kicks you into the wall like a Dragon Ball kick. Mm -hmm. and you slam to the wall. That's wild. I know they gave her that. I thought she had that before, but maybe I'm tripping. I don't think so, because you just like hit the ground, I thought. I got a hard knockdown or something. No anti-air available. Revenant oh, will get the back throw. Rook Rook now in the corner. DI, oh, and there it is. Reacting. Keep it simple. Yup. Mm, punch, punch. I like it. Set point again for, Rev, uh, for Rick Group, excuse yeah, me. Yeah, all right. We've been here before, but Revenant's not out of it yet. I know he likes that two-bar uh, orb super. He punches you back into it. I know he likes. Actually, that. yeah, yeah. We haven't. I haven't seen him use it at all in any of these sets on stream so far. I think it's hard to do, but I know he likes doing it. Maybe yeah, yeah. It might it. be one of those things where tournament ready, he might not be ready for it just because there's a lot of optimal stuff. Oh, he, he hit difficult. that just fine on me a couple times in our uh, set. Of course. So, stream you know, nerves like, now. Is that what? Yeah, it is? I think it's streamer nerves. <laughs> That's crazy. Oh, what a jump in. Revenant not blocking his head. Nope. Back text as well. Push towards the corner. Both sides just looking for the next opportunity. Oh, okay. And I like this as well. Revenant not going for the positional spacing that a perfect parry back throw would have given him. Instead, going for DI for drive gauge damage and life bar damage. Oh, my God. Rick got to eat the fireballs now. This is, this is pretty tough for Rick. But honestly, next hit can kill if it's the right hit. And look at this. He's just flickering. Adding the stagger of just flicker into kill rush backwards. Oh. Bates out a attempt to check the drive rush oh. and look at this. It is game five, final round. You're going all the way, team. Here we go. Only one can go forward. Both phenomenal players, but only one moves on today. I like how they're playing Gognum style in the back right now. Oh my, you think you got a big punch? Let me show you a big punch. Ooh. Stringer on up, yep. pound on those meat grinders, Ooh. and let it loose with a concussion. All right. Oh my god, the pressure. Oh, and oh look nice at this. grab. Ripper out of the doesn't check that. Now he's in a bad situation. Yeah, that's a very bad Anything thing. kills here, and Rick Rip's in burnout. No punish. And Rick giving up the game, holding back. I don't blame you. I think you're plus one with tight. Ed once you're in burnout. Oh, there. maybe burnout, because I know it's minus normally. It's like minus three, I think. Like, I think the EOD version's safe. No shot. It's, it might I'm be, look. I'm going to look. Yeah, maybe minus four. I'm going to pull it up five. real quick. There's no way. I think you're going to jab them out of there. Oh, there goes Mangaka. How's it going, everybody? We are here at the Aki Bi Weekly. It's been a minute, so it's nice to see you all again. I just got back from Evo, so I don't know if y'all been watching that. It's pretty spicy. Apparently, Attack on Texas was last week. I missed that. Ooh. Oh yeah, that Utah one, Colin. I'm I'm mm -hmm. I'm pretty down low key, but I once we get closer, I'll see what my schedule looks yeah, like. Yeah, well, I'd have to put in my time off request a little earlier. The thing that trips me up is like, okay, I could probably send my boys, and y'all would make like a payday with those prize pools out there. But all that shit's on PC. That shit's gonna run like ass. I'm down for whoever. I'm chilling. You know, down for whoever. Oh, is this? Okay, he's going to bully me off the microphone. Slug I see how it is. Bug. I'm sorry, bro. Welcome. Welcome. You Reminding. understand my life now, Slugbug. Washed up player you know. to commentator elite. I am also a washed up player. So. I got smoked today. Is this a jersey? When would you get a team? Like six years ago, dude. Oh. Like, there's an old head in Colorado named Andre. He had this team. Right, sorry, no, say, tell, tell us about your team. So right now, Slug's wearing a jersey. Yeah, I'm just wearing a funny jersey from Andre? that team like six, seven years ago. Okay. Yeah, A4, dude. This is the first team that Punk was ever on. That like, is what? You were on this team? Yeah. Well, it, uh, okay. Saying I'm on a team was a bit of a stretch. We put our, we played in the tournaments together, had the little, you know, we were all, we all hung out. Um, we put With our, it in Punk, front of our names. Though? Punk was around. He didn't engage. <laughs> oh, so he was, oh, so you guys were on the team together, but he was just, I see. He was being. Punk yeah. is still punk after six years, huh? Regardless, Girl I got figure. a funny jersey out of it. 
That's pretty dope. Anyway, we got grand finals happening here at Akihabara. Oh, yeah. Arcade we got the Sunday. Okay, now I don't feel as bad. These two beat me in bracket today. Really? And it's the grand finals. Nice. My round one was TC and my round two was Revenant. That's it. Wow. That's really yeah. tough. To be fair, my round... Uh, yeah, my, my loser's match was against Revenant. He beat me. Oh, all of a sudden, I feel slightly better about going 0-2 today. You should. You should. <laughs> well, it was a really, really small bracket, wasn't it? It was a very small bracket. Uh -huh, uh -huh. I think it says Noah had an upset on Revenant earlier. That's right. I watched it. That was a very that close was a match, very close that match. one. It came down to the pixel, the last pixel. Oh, Ooh, nice anti from wow, Revenant. This was is a clean. jungle. Tight. Oh, oh the oh, shimmy. Punch him. <laughs> such a mean auto shimmy. We love to see it. It's an auto shimmy? What makes it automatic? Well, he just... Um, oh, he just... It literally sets itself up. Yeah, it sets itself up. I see. He doesn't even need to hits, walk. And if it doesn't hit, then that. Then he just oh, blocks then, it. Then he's just chilling. Yeah. Oh, man. Gotta love Street Fighter Six. Oh, nice dragon reaction. punch. He's got that on block. Oh, my. He nice looks like he was in carry stance. Oh, he must have let go. No, he let it go like the frame of. The frame of. Like the frame of. It's all good. TZ just got to get warmed up. He does. He does. I think Revenant's been uh, yeah. playing the last like two, three games straight. TC's still got to warm his hands back yeah, up. Yeah, he's got two sets to play though. Oh uh, yeah. Uh, I love that throw, honestly. But the behind oh. one is even better. The one, two, three into the forward special. Oh god, this corner pressure is a lot for TC right now. He wants to get out. Oh, and he's gotten out. Congratulations. Oh, what are you gonna oh. do with it? Smack nice pressure. Him. Nice. Good throw. A lot of bar level for two. Scoop. Yep. Auto win. Swish, swish, swish. Now you are in the corner. What oh, the? Oh, so fast. We all got hit by that, I swear. So that's the move. I just back right. up and let him scoop. Okay. What's the corner pressure? Nice, perfect parry. Takes back some semblance of a turn for it. What a oh, punch. Yep. Nice. We don't drop those. Very good. Light confirmed. Forward S into down. I don't know what the supers are for Street Fighter. What? Heavy super or something? How do you get the super out? Level two or level three? What are you talking? Like on modern controls. On modern controls. Oh, um, I believe you just pre you press uh, the two the, buttons, the right? Corresponding direction. I think it's down for three and then two buttons. Oh, yeah. down for three, left for one. I believe or it's left for two, special and for one. Yeah, special God. and heavy or know. something. Special right? and heavy. Probably. I know it's one button. I don't. I don't know this. I'm I don't too old for this. Yeah, I'm too I don't old play for the these new controls. The throw loops. TC not wiggling. No. Working against him. He still woke up with a jab despite all the throw loops. He's not afraid. Okay. Yeah. Oh! oh no ah, real I didn't take though. much off it. It's been oh, too far yeah. away. There it is, nice. another one. XDP. Revenant's been hitting some people with that today. Honestly, TC has been doing the, uh, the thing where like he goes for parry, you don't swing into the parry, then he tries to run and get you real quick. He yeah. got me with that a few times today. Really? Yeah, it's pretty good. He's decent at it. All right, we got some advantage. It's on level two. Things built up already. Great oh, desert oh, cheese. Oh, oh. Smack him. Okay, what's the pressure? Get scooped. Yeah, be oh. careful. You might get scooped. There it is. See, he tried to do it right Decent. there. Yeah, yeah. Well, when you're in a uh, parry stance and someone's coming at you about to throw, you, you panic. You're like, what do I do? Yeah, honestly, it's not bad. Pretty good. It's Feels just very kind of high a, level. Yeah, it's just kind of a don't be in the situation in the first place type beat, you know. Nice confirm, okay, okay. but cannot kill. Not going to see a kill. TC's in burnout, but he gets a good throw setup. Makes a nation. One touch will do it for key. Oh, good anti-air crosscut. Oh, misses. Oh, Misses my. the juggle. Takes the cash out. I respect that. Yeah, yeah. And when you're playing Rashid, you're not honestly going for level three. You're going for level two. You are. You are. Level three is just a side quest. Yeah. Nice block from Revenant, taking his time. Looking for the opening. We got both boys just throwing plasma. Oh! This nice. is a very crucial match for Revenant, because if you can really get the 2-0, then TC might as well let him reset it, right? Just kidding! <laughs> <laughs> nobody want to play 10 games? Dog, nobody oh. does. Oh. Oh. Good throw. Plus two? That was a nice drive reversal. That was I nice liked that. Reversal. He waited until after the flicker pulled him in. The flicker's plus two if you block it? The full charge? Uh, I think so, yeah. Okay. I just know he's plus, right? Yeah, it's either plus two or three. I believe it's two. I see. All right, Revenant's almost burned out. Ah, good throw. Oh, oh no. the punish counter was still available? Level three. Level yep. three. That's a 2-0 for Revenant. Up on the board. Looking uh -huh. pretty. Revenant's looking very nice today. I can't lie. Yeah, he's cooking pretty hard today, to be honest. He's cooking. <coughs> Shit, you see there? 
I got it. I got it from the sidelines. Don't worry, I got it. Oh. Yinja's currently hunched over the table, fixing up the, the score right now. Oh, good. Oh, good combo from Revenant. That was pretty. What's the corner pressure? Okay. He's back. Right. Colin's back. No, it's fine, buddy. We got. We held Don't down worry. the fort. I'm there. Nice All TP. Right. Good pressure from TC. Let's see what there is to see. Oh! <laughs> these, these players are pressing nothing. They're respecting each other a bit too much. That's what I'm saying. Wake up, low forward. Never mind. I take it back. If only oh! swinging in this game was worth the shit. If only swinging. <laughs> I feel like just swanging is just not yeah. that good in this game. Unless no. maybe Marissa. No, you will, you will die. That's what I'm swear. saying. That's why they don't press anything, because they know <laughs> that if they're swanging, they're going to get cooked. It, it is potentially punishable by death if you if you swang around. Oh, see that? Oh, what? He swang out a fireball. Oh, <laughs> he, got he ran under. I mean, he predicted that. Oh. He's not winding it up. Nice. Confirmed. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> that was a very tight one. TC got the noggin, the old noggin going now. Okay. All right. Oh, we got some patience. We got some actual footsies in Street Fighter 6. Are you kidding me? Happening right before our very eyes. Uh, I mean, I saw some green shit. I'm not sure. Oh, there's the footsies. Some... There it is. Oh. Footsies in a can right there. Footsies in a can. Footsies in a can. Footsies. And, oh. and he won neutral. He got, he got footsied. He yeah, got footsied. he got footsied. Outplayed. Yeah. <laughs> okay. They got some nice neutral going on. Revan's almost burned out. Trying to preserve it. Uh oh. Nice jump out. Oh, but the drive reversal is clean. He sleeps. We got the wiggle. We got the footsie wiggle. Oh, good overhead. TC okay. special. He loves that. He loves it. The overhead's good. Every little bit counts. Every, Every little bit counts, yeah. buddy. I think he's scared of Remnant randomly level 3 him here. Because I feel like Dude, that's I would. what I'm scared of right now. You can see, if he starts swinging that fireball just a little bit too long, we got a level 3 on our hands. Oh, oh my. The anti -air. fake, the fake, the fake. What a check. Nice. That's good knowledge from Rev. Oh, my God. The Rashid parry so troll. Crosses his arm, puts his legs out. God, wow. good anti-air. I would not have tried oh, to Put him away. Up. Put him away. Oh, oh baked it out, kills him. It. Okay, okay, okay. All nice. right, we got one up for TC. One up for TC. That's pretty smart, actually. He got the hit and let Revenant hang himself. He did, he did. Because we all know he was slamming that level. <laughs> the DP or the level three <laughs> after. Oh, well, the punish uh, gunner was still nice. active. Had a long recovery. All right, TC's almost burned for this combo. He's get off it. Uh, he gets he an anti-air. Yeah, he gets anti-air to the face. Oh, now he's in the corner. Was it worth? Oh! oh, oh, he's out. Down the hustle. It. Oh, oh we sucks. got we got a rough dance happening. Oh, what ooh, a check! Ooh, ooh. Watch yeah. your toes, I Rev. Oh, up. yeah, let's go. Watch your head, Rev. Uh -oh. Okay, good wake up throw. TC's back online. Never mind. Ooh, he's still playing. What are we going to see? What are we going to see? No overhead. Raw overhead. Oh, oh my. The man. dragon punch. If Rev sees green, that's going to happen. Guaranteed. Yeah, that's just facts. He's trained his eyesight to respond to green with that button, that key strip. Oh, no. Oh, see, no. It, it works with him and against him. It does. It does. Blessing and a curse, that one. Hey. Hey. Stay in the oh corner. Oh, my God. Green shit? Uh-oh. Flicker. Oh. Oh, shit. Okay, that's easy in the corner. Oh. Okay, we're gonna see Rev. Oh, he's burned out off that little, little, little tap. Oh, of the air this jump. is TC's game to win here. Try not to spend all his cash. Spends it anyway. Now he's winning neutral. We're gonna see level two. That's true. He has officially won neutral. I didn't know TC was so good at neutral. This is crazy. It's over. Oh, Man, nice block on Revenant's part, just holding everything. Oh, oh, oh. Ti, oh, oh, fuck oh, it. Oh, oh. Oh. Rev back online. Oh, he gets hit with the oh, driver get some. No kill. Oh. Why didn't you do the run cancel stuff? I didn't react well enough. Okay, Draw overhead. Red. Oh, bust out. It's okay. Revenant's not spending. How plus, plus buddy? Yeah, there's Ooh. no way Revenant spends anything there. He's gonna save for this round. That is the most interesting anti-air I've ever seen. <laughs> the <laughs> no. feet in the air, pretty good. Oh, oh, oh we got some pressure. Oh, Rev knows where to interrupt. We're trying to shimmy. Oh my not, god. No dice, not happening, buddy. Nice tech. Not in my skies. Ooh, you spent four bars just to get slapped. <laughs> <laughs> True. <laughs> oh, he's burnt out. Oh, good tech from TC. Yeah, TC got to find that end. Burned out. What a check. What a check. Just getting a little love yeah, tap. Go for overheads. Overheads. Fuck it. Just do a ton of them. Little pokes. Little. Oh. Good no. Entire. The jump in, TC. No. Can't jump against this man. That's all I'm saying. 
His uh, anti-air game is too good. Uh-uh. Oh, oh, never mind. It's too good. It you dropped. were right. It's it too good. It was too good. <laughs> it worked against him there. No anti -air. Oh, he PC. blocks the raw overhead. The unblockable. He blocked oh, it. Oh. Slap him. Slap him. Stinky feet. Tornado feet. Uh -oh. Good air there. Nice stack. Both these guys are reacting very well to each other's oh, shenanigans. He wants to win with great desert cheese. Oh, oh is it over? I think it's over. Unless he dropped for no oh, reason. We're back in the corner, Rev. I Level gotta two. Hold it. Footsie time. Oh, he got schmixed. Uh -oh. I got schmixed. We all got hit. That's all you got, though? Yeah. That's okay. That's not bad. Okay. Get some basic pressure. Come on, TC. Trying to find the in here. Oh, wiggle, 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 wiggle. Take oh, it to game five. Oh, I want game 10, much. honestly. Game 10? I want oh, game 10. Oh, doesn't. What's the TC just oh! not doing real combos? He's doing some weird like little TC is click, slowly. click, 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 click. Getting back his momentum. All right, Revenant. Now you go for the reset here. This is the Takes biggest the game scrap 10. fest I've ever seen in my life. Yeah, it's the stage, man. You can't see anything. It's the stage. It's the stage. It's weird. What are you talking about? <laughs> the lava, bro. I can't see anything. <laughs> red shirt, red lava. You know. Oh, that's true. That's true. <laughs> Red shoes, I can't tell when he's Peter in my face. At least Rev's out here looking like a banana. I like it. I Bananas can see are him. cool. Oh, oh my god, what an overhead. overhead. Good damage in the corner. Oh, TC got momentum got right pressure. now. Pressure. Oh, the shimmy. That's so brutal. Rev finally fell for it. Oh, yeah. Oh, Must that out. was a good reaction from Rev. All right. Oh, burns himself out to not deal with the pressure. Yeah. Well, I don't know if it's oh, worth let's it. see how that pans out for him. Uh, not well. Not great. The verdict nope. is not well. All right, Revenant, one away from getting the reset, keeping us here for game 10. Five oh, eyes. Oh, he tried to empty jump to bait out the. That three piece. Oh! Clean. This oh. is a little slugfest. They're swinging. See, it's now we're swinging. We devolved from. Slugs. Not swaying into only swinging. This is exclusively swinging. This is swaying off. Oh, oh. yeah. Uh, uh. Pressure from Rev. Oh yeah, take me to game time, Ooh, baby. Who trying to instant overhead? Take me to game ten. I'm wanting. Game ten. Game Give it to ten. Me. Oh, but TC says I'll hold on a second. It's not over till it's over. And it's. Oh. Over. Can see it. That's it. For, oh. That's it. As long as he hits the Momochi. Oh, he Let's cheesed it. No, he went for the easy Momochi. That's, pretty easy. That's not the Momochi. Yeah, it's not. But we take it. That's the All right, Walker. reset. New stage, please. Switch the stage. All right, we're, we're right in it. The stage. They like the stage. All right, got to let us know we're on a Kuma patch or Bison patch, even though Kuma was only new for like like a week or two. Huh? Akuma was only new for like a week or two, right? Yeah, and then that, Bison came out. That guy did last like a month and a half. Yeah. Poor guy. Didn't Poor have dude. a lot of life life. And now we're going to be stuck with Bison for a minute. Until Terry comes out like, God, next month? Oh, no shot, really? Yeah, he's oh. getting to, um, uh, like, you can play him at event businesses. Uh, oh, weeks. combo breaker or whatever the hell. No, that's not even sick. combo breaker. Like two different other events. Oh, random like little ones? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like anime panels and stuff. Let's go. It's going to oh. be tight. We'll see how he, he plays. I swear TC just not finishing combos. That's what I think I'm seeing. That's what I feel like I'm seeing. He, it, it, it's a bit nerve-wracking, isn't it, though, to finish yeah. a combo when your Rashid in a finished combo dropped looks like a block eagle swipe. And then you eat a full punish. punish. Yeah. So I understand the fear. That's true. It does look better than. Oh, what a bust out! That was crispy. Uh oh. Nice. Oh what? Didn't answer that one. Oh, he answered that one. See what I mean? But he got that hit, then just like backs up. I was like, TZ, just hit him. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He got the yeah. hit. He's a little too comfortable in the nooch. He's yeah. gotta. He's gotta bust some ass. Okay, Rev is doing some, some kill Russian. Chuck and plasma. Oh my god, it. was that Wifty P that I just saw? <laughs> I don't Don't worry to. about it, don't worry okay, about it. Okay, I won't think about that one. Yeah. Okay, we're chilling. Man, these guys are feeling each other out. They're getting a bit winded, I can tell. They're getting a bit exhausted. And god, after a reset, man, yeah, you gotta start pacing yourself. No, this game honestly is very exhausting. It's the most exhausting video game ever made, I swear to god. Yup. We're holding though. Oh, nice. He sees green, he hits it. It's gonna happen. 
Oh my, what a tech TC not giving up the freaking round. There it is. Big jabs from Red. I'm there hitting him with a wow, won't you die? Oh, good air to air from TC. He's been really good about um, air to airing as an alternative to anti airing because Rashid's anti airs are just not that. Are they not? I mean, he got up tornado, seems alright. Nice bait. You do, it's just so hard to. You almost gotta predict that. You know what you can't predict? Speaking What's gonna happen next? Level, <laughs> two, level two. Oh, get scoops. Oh, your footsies are good, Rev. Oh my god, it. it's just on the Ooh. screen, and now he's almost burnt out. Throw this. And now he's on. Do it again. Oh. Oh, good confirm. That was a very. I mean, if you're TC, this is fine, honestly. All I the would, meters gone. You get yeah. The likely modern damage. That looks like modern damage. You're chilling. Oh, oh no, never no. mind. It's Reverend okay. If he lives this, it's actually still okay for TC. You gotta just find a way in, though. That's the hard part. You do, you do. Just mash uh, uh, DI, fuck it. Or tornadoes or something. Oh, he's trying to get level two, look. <laughs> yeah. He just needs one more. Too bad it's not Let's get a TC. Right. Oh my god, why would you jump to get it? He's got level two now. There it is. Okay, but what's he gonna do? He's unleashing the beast. Oh, he oh, tries the he cheese. T cheese. T cheese. T cheese. He tried oh. the T cheese. That's what you get for T cheese. If you're gonna cheese, you should have done it earlier, I think. Because he could have just kept closing the gap and kicking tornadoes. Well, he only just got level two, I think. He was one tap away with like halfway through the uh, exhaust. Oh. It was it was close. It was close. But he chose the jump and got anti-aired for it, which kind of sealed the deal. Low yeah, key. that makes sense. Man, Revenant just cooking on the anti-air. Nice block Whoa. punish. No real punish. Uh oh. Okay, Rev recognized that one. He got <laughs> some damage off it. Slapped his kneecap. <laughs> that was the Slapped punish. Slapped his like, kneecap. <laughs> oh, scary. All right, come on, TC. Looking alive. Well, these guys are looking pretty good right yeah, now. Revenant has so much control right now. He's really just taking his time in Nuch and holding it down. Uh oh, TC gets out. It's a wake up. Level two okay. for breakfast. Eat some footsies, boy. Yep. Oh, push him back. Good, get off me. Good, get off me. Text the throw. He's ready for this. He's not scared of that tornado anymore. Nice hit. He's seen it a million times. Ooh. Does he go for it? Does Momochi. He... Give me the Momochi. Oh, he doesn't Give go me. for it. Okay. Oh, it works out anyway. It works out. It works out. He gets, he gets an update. Oh, no, I want the Momochi too. I don't even, I'm not going to lie to you, Inja. Yeah. I don't know what the Momochi looks like. <laughs> I don't. So, so he throws the orb, then he does the uppercut, and yeah. then when he goes in, but when he goes in, he does the EX, so he goes down. He does the punch down. Yeah. And he punches the back of your head into the, the back of the ball. And That's then he tough. can juggle you off the ball. But you have to delay it manual timing. It's not auto timed. Yeah, That's yeah, why it's yeah, so hard cool. to do. TC's having troubles. Oh, Woo! no. Rev is looking good today, boys. Yeah, Rev is trying to take the whole thing with a quick swift 3-0. Can TC make the adjustments? Maybe. Oh, OK. That was Wow. That's that was TC. a far and good counter hit confirmed. I definitely think TC's a momentum player, so if he can get started, it's looking good for him. But he's been so passive in the last few like interactions. It's yeah. Rough. Who knows? Maybe the past seven games, five, six games have been download rounds. Hmm. Interesting. It's been all download rounds. Well, hopefully he and can now download. Now that TC is burned out, he's ready to rock. <laughs> He's gonna need to start executing the files instead of just downloading them soon. Yeah. <laughs> that, no, that's fair. That's fair. Oh man, uh -oh. that was real, I guess. Uh oh. I think he tried to jump there. Files unexecuted. Yeah. Oh no. Download unutilized. Revenant is up heavily right now. It's looking like it's a Revenant tournament today, it, but it we will might, see. It might be. If he can make the miracle comeback. We got level two. What are we gonna do? Oh oh oh. That's all right, damage, I suppose. Okay. Leading into some more good damage. Set up. Good throw. Okay. Scoop, scoop. Can he win with throw loops? Maybe not. He can't. He can't. Revenant's too willing. Just throw that wake up the XDP. Nice. Right, Finishes right. a damn combo. Let's go, TC. I'm loving the slappage. A lot of slappage. Oh! You could say that was a knee slapper. <laughs> 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 Nice drive. Dude, this kind of thing. Dragon Ball levels of back and forth. I'm loving this. Oh, okay. Run in. 
Nice oh, grab. Good throw. Good kick throw. the tornado. Oh, he can't kick after that? All right, yeah, it's a little too far. I, I like it. Throw a loop bitch. Oh, throw overhead. overhead. End of the combo. That's a meaty overhead combo. The TC. Gotta always hit that. Set up. Oh, oh could have blocked there for sure. Yeah, yeah, he hit some buttons. He hit some buttons for sure. Oh, what are we seeing, boy? Oh! You won't let Revenant take the advantage. Okay, the Says overhead. you're not allowed. Yeah. Oh, my God, okay. TC. One more, like, sneeze will do it for TC. Slap the kneecaps. You've done it once. Oh, oh my God. Slap Put the face. caps. Yeah. Kicking in. Oh, oh no. He all of a great. Sudden. That was looking like a Revenant game to win. Oh, oh, oh. This is level three. Oh, He's going to no. spend it. Why not? This is going to suck for TC. I think he got one more, but Burnout makes it rough. Oh, oh. okay. He got a couple. And Revenant's in full. Oh. Uh. Okay, okay. TC's in tired gamer mode. However, he's got the tornado. You've got the Wizard of Oz tornado. Oh, oh. what a run through into the scoop. <laughs> Whoever's playing to the safe is not ready for that. He says, okay. That was probably the longest rounds in the set so far. God, yeah. We've had some long rounds. Yeah. Right. It just progressively gets slower as the game goes farther. Great, I'd say that's indicative of good, some good learning that's worth ever seeing in front of us oh, right now. Oh, a lot of Scoopies and things are looking revenant. Oh, Trying to close oh, this oh, one oh, out. Oh, oh, perfect! Oh, mama. Revenant trying to go home as the winner today. And TV, it. stop it. Momentum change. Oh, Rev's taking an early lead uh, again. Uh, yup. Toss, TC toss. Is not oh, now hard. he is, and he loses for it. Level two? Here. Oh, it's what are we gonna see? Throw the orb in his face. Fuck it. Oh, the oh shimmy! Oh my god! And that'll do it for Revenant, Dad. The Revenant with the victory. He will Today's be our Aki bi-weekly champion. What's the date today? Um, the 18th of oh, August. Oh nine eighteen. Wait. Oh eight eight. Oh eight one eight. Oh eight eight eight. I. Eight, oh eight one eight. eight. Oh eight one eight two four. Eight. All multiples of eight into eight six seven five four. three oh nine. Iron. Eight six that was seven great five from three oh nine. That's just a classic. Yeah, I love that song. That almost as much as I love that set. That was a tight oh. set. That was a good reset from the boys. That was a good oh, reset. Well, I think TC really lost his momentum after the reset had happened, and then he just couldn't get his footing. Revenant just didn't have to think about quarter circles at the end there. That's true. He didn't have to think about quarter circles. No mental stack in his brain. <laughs> at all. Just hit that DP. Input. Yeah. Easy, easy as. You see yeah. green? A bah, and then bust out. Honestly, the jersey's sick, though. I do like it. Thank you. Say. It's, it's pretty funny. Andre, Same team as Punk. A4 <laughs> Just... Andre. If you see this, brother, I miss you. A4 I, Andre. I still, I still rep it, brother. I still oh, rep it. Oh, snap. That's crazy. Uh, but no, that was good from the both of them. Um, Revenant was just very on point today. I think he, he outlasted everyone in terms of. He lost to Noah. So it wasn't even TZ put him in loser side. No, it wasn't. It was it was no open on loser side, and then he came all the Red, way back, he right? Just, he just locked in, man. I watched that set against him and Noah, and he did he did a lot better. He did a lot better. He really just like started focusing on what he was doing wrong. Yeah. Keep he kept doing what he's doing right, and it was simple as that. Hmm. Really Very good sad. job, Rev. Very strong player. So I think we got next guilty gear strive top four. Ooh. That's the plan. So if you guys are sticking around for that, I'll be playing that. So yes, I will. I will not. <laughs> um, but cheer on my boy Yinja. Thank you, he's bro. Gonna, he's gonna win it. Well, do my damn. Are you playing Guilty Gear? Yeah, I play May. Oh, that's right. You play May. I play I May, the Dude, cute, the funny dolphin girl. I don't know if I want you to win anymore. Oh, <laughs> you're one of those people. Huh? No, it's okay. I, you know what? Because you're you. <laughs> hey, if it, if it counts or anything, I'm one of the last like three May players in the world. So. Really? Does she suck now? I mean, no one plays her. Is Everyone she says she's top tier, but no one who actually plays the game competitively plays her. Oh, she's like Guile in six. Yeah, she's not actually that good. Like, is she's kind of good, but... Really? Is, is she like one of those characters where she's good, but there's just characters in the game that are what she does, but better? Um, It kind of depends what you're looking for. I think she has she's well-rounded, right? If you're a well-rounded player, that's why I like playing her. She has a little yeah. bit of everything. I mean, no projectiles, a beach ball. But, like, she has really good neutral, and she has really, really good damage. My brain considers Dolphin a, be 
Oh, it's projectile. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's like a lariat. <laughs> but the, on the downside, though, there are characters that, like, one, either don't play neutral, or two, if they knock you down, they could just win the set for free. Just because mixing that game is, like, that's true. nasty. That's very true. You All know right. what I'm saying? All right, we're going into Guilty Gear, everybody. I'm hopping off. Um, Are you out of here? That was a good Street Fighter Six. Um, All right. I hope Guilty Gear is an amazing time. Thank you, brother. Uh, good luck. Thank you. In your run. And I will see everybody later. I think I'll talk about this first match. Talk about what's been going on behind the scenes. Because Hacks actually had a couple upsets today. Beat uh, Harko and beat me. I don't know if me is an upset, but Harko, I would consider an upset. So that's pretty spicy. 